all humans. Uh, we don't see any difference between being a Palestinian or being a Jew. We all deserve to live a peaceful life without war, without fightings. A Montreal rally downtown organized by pro-Palestinian youth groups and organizations outside the Guy Concordia metro station. I am from Gaza as well, and my, both of my grandparents' houses, they were demolished in the past two days. It's the emotional value that's attached to the house where my both of my parents grew up and my childhood memories, it's all been affected. I came here to support at least this, the minimum support for uh, the people in Gaza, uh, to, to tell them they are, uh, they are special, they, they are doing what we cannot do for Palestine. Hiba Zakut has many friends and family in Gaza, and she fears for their lives. That's the minimum I could do for the Palestinian people, for our family in Gaza, to stand with them and give them support. Our hearts with them always. We're demonstrating that uh, we are in solidarity with each other. We stand for the liberty of each and the freedom of each and security of each. And so we consider that it's possible for Israel to negotiate you know, with the Hamas in order to achieve a ceasefire and to stop the violence because it's going to escalate. And we have to understand what is the root cause behind all of this. I'm in contact with my Palestinian friends because I was living in Nablus in the West Bank for many years, oftentimes. And uh, they're afraid, you know, because anything can happen now because the violence is unleashed. Now, we are demonstrating on the streets of Montreal, just like last weekend, for the lives that are being lost. We pray and hope to God that this ends with no more suffering. This can end in peace. In Montreal, Brittany Enriquez, City News.